You all know that Amy husband is not her choice, so she wants a new husband to marry to be happy and peaceful in her life, and if she can't be happy, why should she marry and stay with him? So she has chosen another new husband to live happily, who is her new husband, what is his identity, how did she get married, I will tell them all these things in today's video. But before that I want to tell one more thing. Amy Slayton returns to social media after hiatus, shares sweet moments with her sons. 1000 LB Sisters star Amy Slayton has been notably absent from social media for several months. It's not uncommon for TLC stars to take breaks from the spotlight and re-emerge when a new season of their show airs. With 1000 LB Sisters back on TLC, some fans speculated that Amy's absence might be linked to her recent legal troubles involving drug charges. Fans will recall that Amy and a male companion were arrested after authorities found illegal substances in their car. Police have been called to the scene after Amy claimed she was bitten by a camel at the zoo. During their investigation, officers discovered the drugs and took both Amy and the man into custody. Despite this, Amy is back on Instagram as the latest season of 1000 LB Sisters unfolds. So, what did she share with her followers? Hashtag, hashtag, hashtag Amy Slayton shares adorable photos of her sons. While the drug charges may have played a role in Amy's decision to lay low, she has not posted much on social media since July. Her last update celebrated her son Glenn's second birthday, featuring a sweet message alongside photos of her little boy. However, Amy recently returned to Instagram with a new post, simply captioned, 2024. The update included fresh pictures of her two sons, Glenn and Gage, dressed in matching Halloween pajamas, happily playing on the floor. Fans, who had been worried about Amy's well-being and the safety of her children, were relieved to see the boys smiling and looking well. Her followers responded with enthusiasm. Gage looks like Uncle Chris so handsome. I see a lot of Amanda and Gage. I'm kinda glad he's looking less like his dad. Glenn looks like mommy. Oh wow, they're getting so big, so cute. Hashtag 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 Amy's mental health journey in the latest season. This season of 1000 LB Sisters highlights Amy's journey as she navigates life as a single mother. Following her split from Michael Halterman, Amy initially struggled with her emotions. But with the support of her family, she appears to be on a path of healing. Amy's efforts have also led to a surprising weight loss. During a family weigh-in, she discovered she had lost more weight than expected. She humorously attributed the loss to a messy divorce and the challenges of caring for two toddlers. Like her siblings, Amy hopes to undergo skin removal surgery, but it remains unclear whether that will happen soon. Fans are eager to see what's next for Amy, both on and off screen. What do you think of Amy's latest Instagram post featuring her sons? Do you believe she will achieve her goal of skin removal surgery? Share your thoughts in the comments. Viewers of 1000 LB Sisters are voicing concerns over Amy Slayton, after spotting cigarette but scattered across the floor of her messy home. Fans are especially worried, as Amy lives with her two toddlers. This isn't the first time Amy has faced criticism over her living conditions. In the past, she has received backlash from viewers who were concerned about the environment she's raising her children in. Recently, TLC posted footage of Amy's home, revealing the untidy and unsanitary conditions. Fans of the show have expressed concerns, suggesting that the clutter and mess could negatively impact her children. Many think that her home is not suitable for young kids, and they fear the condition of the house is affecting them. At 36, Amy Slayton has frequently been in the spotlight for reasons beyond her weight loss journey. After a recent arrest, where she was taken into custody for illegal drug possession and child endangerment, Amy posted new pictures of her children, Glenn and Gage. In the Instagram post, the two boys were wearing matching Halloween-themed pajamas, and Amy captioned the photo simply, 2024. The arrest occurred after the Crockett County Sheriff's Department detected a suspicious odor in Amy's vehicle while she was visiting a Tennessee zoo in early September. The authorities investigated and arrested Amy, along with Brian Scott Levorn, after discovering illicit substances in the car. In a more recent clip shared by TLC, Amy admitted to being a hoarder, acknowledging the chaotic state of her house. The camera footage from her home showed cigarette butts, garbage, and food waste littering the kitchen floor. Fans voiced their concerns with one writing, no idea how CPS hasn't taken her kids away. That house is filthy, ridiculous, 
and another commenting on the dangers of cigarette butts on the floor with small children. Amy has previously faced criticism for her living conditions. During one memorable moment from the show, viewers spotted a cockroach in the background, which led to a flood of negative comments. Amy later admitted that the backlash affected her deeply, causing her to feel like a bad mom. In a December 2021 episode, Amy opened up about her struggles with hoarding, revealing that her mother and grandmother were also hoarders, which influenced her behavior. Despite her ongoing battles, Amy continues to face public scrutiny over the conditions in which she raises her children, asterisk asterisk 1000 LB sisters. Tammy Slayton's hilarious reaction to Amy's bizarre shrimp Alfredo recipe asterisk asterisk. In a recent clip shared by TLC, 1000 LB sister star Tammy Slayton had a priceless reaction to her sister Amy's unconventional cooking style during a kitchen session. As Amy confidently stirred a unique concoction, Tammy was left both shocked and concerned. Known for her adventurous cooking methods, Amy once again surprised her elder sister with an unusual twist on a classic dish, leaving Tammy questioning her sister's culinary choices. Hashtag 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 Amy's unique take on shrimp Alfredo. Amy Slayton decided to make shrimp Alfredo with a twist that left Tammy feeling uneasy. While Tammy watched in disbelief, Amy grabbed an array of unexpected ingredients, including chamoy, ranch powder, red onion, garlic, adobo, and even bagel seasoning. As she added the odd mix to the pot, Tammy's expressions of disgust grew stronger. Amy explained that she doesn't follow traditional recipes and prefers to cook based on her instincts, claiming that her grandmother's cooking style inspires her. According to Amy, she often grabs whatever spices are available without much thought, adding a personal touch to each dish. This carefree attitude seemed to worry Tammy even more. Hashtag 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 Tammy's concerns over Amy's cooking. As Amy prepared her dish, Tammy couldn't hide her fear and voiced her concerns. Tammy, sitting in the kitchen, asked Amy what she was cooking, to which Amy confidently replied, Shrimp Alfredo my way. However, Tammy grew increasingly horrified as Amy dumped several heaping spoons of garlic into the pot. In the confessional, Tammy revealed her true feelings about Amy's cooking, admitting she was truly freaking scared by the bizarre combinations. Flashbacks from previous episodes show Amy making other odd dishes, like pineapple lasagna, which had similarly left Tammy bewildered. But the real shock came when Amy added her secret ingredient, white chocolate chips.